Deion Sanders loves to keep people guessing, and he's done it again. When asked about his time in Colorado, the Buffs head coach had an intriguing response. Instead of giving a straightforward answer, he played a Uno reverse card move, cleverly dodging the question. It all started with Colorado's new tight end commit, Zane DeSouza. This Loveland high school kid pledged his loyalty to the Buffs, becoming the first in state player to join Coach Prime's squad. Now, the three star TE is a massive six foot six, 260 pound blocker who is already making waves, not just for his size, but also for spilling some tea about his new HC. During an interview with CU Buffs Alan Matt McChesney, De Souza revealed a surprising conversation with Sanders. When De Souza asked if the coach would stick around next year, Sanders pulled a classic Dion move. I asked him, Are you going to be here next year? And he was like, Are you going to come and transfer? De Souza said, Considering the massive roster turnover Colorado experienced this offseason, it's a bold statement. With over 40 players entering the transfer portal and a similar number coming in, the program has dramatically transformed this year. However, Sanders' later response suggests he's in it for the long haul. I've already gone to the NFL. I've done all that. I don't want the NFL. I'm fine where I am right now. I'll retire right now as HC. I'm fine. I'm staying. De Souza recalls Dion's words. Now, the coach is ensuring his commitment to the program by attracting more top recruits like De Souza. Some even believe a five-star commitment could further solidify Dion's stay in Boulder. While his sons Shiloh and Shadur Sanders are getting ready to take their talents to the NFL, Coach Prime is focused on building the next generation of buffs. He's already locked down some top four-star recruits like Alex Graham, Chauncey Gooden, and Quanell X. Farrakhan Jr., but Sanders isn't satisfied. He's set his sights on even bigger fish, like five-star quarterback Julian Lewis. The coach rolled out the red carpet for Lewis this June. And since then, there's been a lot of speculation about Lewis committing to the Buffs, with several cryptic posts. Even Matt McChesney is convinced that Lewis is going to choose Colorado. He believes Juju's commitment will be a game-changer, adding, I think Dion is going to stay in Boulder. I do think that Juju will commit to CU that will keep seating around, that will keep the offensive linemen around, that'll keep the other receivers around. Now, Dion is also already looking ahead to the 2026 recruiting class. He hosted quarterback Jaden O'Neal and offered a scholarship to wide receiver Malachi Tony. Sanders is proving he's in it for the long haul with such future-centric moves. 